Oh, g'day everyone. Welcome back to the pitch. It is Jared here. Another edition getting ready for Friday night's game against Melbourne Victory. Far out. I can't wait for this game. And a man who knows a little bit about Melbourne. It's disgusting that I even mentioned it. We're going to talk to him in a sec. Mate Dugantic. Mate Dugantic, thank you very much for joining me on the pitch, my friend. Cheers, thanks for having me. I've been waiting so long to get you here. Um, I don't know if you've been aware, but we started the pitch, then our cameraman went away on a junket overseas, so we stopped it for a while. I'm like, I need to talk to Mate. So um, you're here now, which is fantastic. Uh, the way that the pitch works is I ask you some questions, then we get into social media, then you sign a Snapchat and all this other stuff. Anyway, um, Enzo's Restaurante is Mate's sponsor. You've been there, haven't you? Yes. How amazing is it? It's top notch, yeah. It's yep. good. They've got like a takeaway section as well. I have the lasagna there all the time. They've got this pasta with avocado and, and chicken, that's right. Yeah, that's right. And I'd love a free meal there, Enzo, if you are watching. Fantastic. <laughs> hey, so we are looking forward to Friday night. The game's going to be live on Fox and also SBS. Um, you are quite familiar with both Melbourne sides, and we're not going to hold that against you. Of course, you have played for both um, the Victory and Hearts slash City. But now you're on the other side, where you have to hate the Melbourne sides. How's it feeling going into Friday night? It's good. It's good, to be honest. I think uh, the fact that we're doing so well of late as well, it's, uh, it's an exciting game, I think, it's going to be on Friday night. Now, when we build up these games here in Adelaide, and when you were representing the Melbourne sides playing over here, you would have seen that we, we built it up, man. This is like the original rivalry. What was it like for you as a victory or Heart City player? Did you guys look at it the, the same way, especially with the victory? I think, I think with victory as well, I think victory had the other derby with the Sydney derby and, and this Adelaide derby as well. So that was a, at victory, we probably saw it a lot more as Adelaide see it here. Whereas at City, I think uh, being a new club and just having the other, being the other Melbourne team, it became more, that became more of a rivalry rather than the Adelaide and, and Melbourne then. Yeah, now you have been at the club obviously since the start of the season and I was reading some stuff about you where you said you were really looking forward to coming to Adelaide and playing underneath um, Guillermo and also with the other boys. What, what's it been like for you? I mean, you've scored already, which I'm sure is a relief because you've come over here to score some goals, but how's the experience been so far? Yeah, it's been good. Um, unfortunately, I've only scored the one goal, but so far, yeah, it's been really good. Uh, the boys are fantastic and get along with them all really well and we've got our little uh, training menu up in Playford as well, so it's going really well and enjoying my time here in Adelaide. What about lifestyle, Marte? Now, do you have a missus over here? Are you living by yourself? What's the deal? I'm living by myself, but I do have a, do have a missus. She's back home in Melbourne. Is she going to move over here? Uh, potentially, we're waiting and see. So hopefully she, she she can. Okay, now I've got one more question. Um, you've got beautiful shaven legs. Now they're not like um, Tarek Elrich shaven and waxed and laser therapy and stuff, but you've got some ink on them. Now a couple of people have been asking what's going on because where you see your socks pulled up, but this is really cool and I know it means a lot to you. So I just wanted to ask what it's all about because people may be watching this going, I just want to look at Marte's legs. Um, yeah, it's old uh, Croatian writing called uh, Glaglitsa, so it's pretty much represents everyone in the family. It's just lettering like of my parents, my grandparents, and my siblings. Awesome. All right, well, the tough part's out of the way. The camera guy loved just going down there. He's going to do that slow motion with some porno music or something. No, you won't. He might. Anyway, let's do social media next on the pitch with Mate Duganzic. With acres of space, so he can really pick his play up the bowl. Wants the ball into the box, there it is! Plenty of time and it's Mate Duganzic! Welcome back to the pitch, Mate Duganzic is here. How many people call you mate? Not many, to be honest. What about other ground MCs that can't read properly? There's a lot of them. Uh, I usually get Marty or Matty or something like that. All right, well, if you are watching other MCs, just chill out, all right, and show some respect to Marte. Um, now, social media, I want to ask some questions from people. Thank you very much to uh, Enzo's Restaurant as well for sponsoring Marte. Um, phone's ringing. That is just disgraceful. Don't answer it! Don't answer the phone! Um, this never happens. <laughs> Where's the phone? Okay, it's fine now. Now, are you on social media? Um, no, not really, no. Not Instagram or Twitter or anything like that? Oh, I do have Facebook, but that's all. That's okay. Friends and family. No, that's totally fine because there's a lot of players who use this environment here on the pitch to pick up women. Um, okay. And you've got a missus and you don't need to do that. So, um, all right. Now, this is from Facebook. This is from Philip Rollis. If you score the winner on Friday night, will you celebrate? 
Most definitely. That's fantastic. That is a big <laughs> get stuffed victory. Um, from Brendan Pusasiri, um, how far off are you from your best form? Um, I don't know. It's very difficult to say. Every game is pretty, pretty much different. I suppose I just want to be out there playing as much as I possibly can. Can I ask a personal question? You don't need to answer this, but you have to because you're on camera. I love you coming off the bench because of the impact you provide with your pace up the wing. And I think it's really important, but I'm sure you as a player would love to start on the ground. Like, do you find that both roles are really different when you have, say, an 18 to 30 minute patch to go, just run as hard as you can and score some goals or start until you're cooked? Yeah, pretty. Oh, they're completely different. I suppose every footballer wants to play as much as they possibly can. And I'm no different. So, yeah. um, but if you start on the bench, you've got to do a job. So, as you said, you know, you get your little little bit of time, and you try and do as much as you possibly can during that period. Awesome. This is from Instagram Abby Mac Eleven. If you could play alongside any player, who would it be? In what are we talking? Presently? In the in the world, yeah. Presently, or are we talking like in the past? They can be dead. Yeah. It's fine. Oh, okay. Um, ooh. I don't know. I used to like Terry Henry as a, as a child, so yep. he'd be one that I'd like to play with. Fantastic. This is from Steve underscore G224. How did it feel to get your first goal for the club? Yeah, it was fantastic. Bit of relief, to be honest. Um, hadn't scored in a while, so yeah, and I was pretty happy, even though it was a little bit of a tap in. Or, and was Pablo well, upset about that? Because Pablo had a bit to do with it. Pablo likes scoring goals. He does. He does. And he always <laughs> has that nose to get in, get in a good position as well. So, um, no, it was a great ball by Craig, whatnot. So, yeah, thank you for that. Awesome. Did you get to keep the match ball? No. Because uh, old mate from Wellington, who's a dude who scored four goals on the weekend for Wellington? Blake Powell. Yeah, he was all up and about. He was just about to go on the interview. Get me the match ball! And he got it, but I guess he scored four goals. Yeah, I think it's when you score a hat-trick. You know? Okay, fair enough. Sorry, Blake, if you are watching, you may be streaming this online. Um, Jaden.Voss, finally, what's your dream club? Dream club? Um, oh, to be honest, as a child, uh, being of Croatian descent, you want to be playing for a, someone of, like... In Croatia, so yep. yeah, um, I, my dream club is Dinamo Zagreb, I suppose, yeah, playing for them. I didn't understand a word of that. Um, can you say that name again? Dinamo Zagreb. Oh, yeah, yeah. <sighs> All right, I'm not very good at English anyway. Um, Marte Dugantic is here. We're going to get into signed Snapchat in a second on the pitch. Dugantic in space. Thirio. Thirio. Super here we are, the pitch. Friday night, Melbourne victory, it is going to be huge. If you can't get over to Melbourne, make sure you watch it on Fox and also SBS as well. The whole nation will be watching your Adelaide United take on the victory. Marte Dugantic will be there. He's sponsored by Enzo's Restaurante. We're home in a few weeks as well against Brisbane Royal. We've got memberships, we've got merchandise. We've also got Snapchat. So Marte, this is a time where you take a snap of yourself. Okay. Yep, so just a selfie. Just, Smile, yeah, just of yourself. That's just a normal one. Yeah, just, I don't know. Okay. do whatever you like, mate. I've got, you know, there's a weird filter on it which makes your face look all weird. I'm obsessed with it at the moment. Okay, I haven't seen that. Yeah. Okay, well, you, you just take it whenever. Because, okay. Yeah. Perfect. Then sign your name on it. So okay. you have to press the, the yep, yeah, that, that thing. Yeah, sign your name. Anyway, while Marte is doing that, um, please share this video on all of our social media accounts. If you have any questions, um, of course, we want to ask the boys what you want to know the answers to. So Marte has been fantastic today. That is beautiful. I'm going to turn that around. Look at that. Look at that. Follow us on Snapchat. All the behind the scenes information and things like that. Mate, um, good luck. Friday night, Marte. It is going to be a huge game. And let's keep this unbeaten run going because it was fantastic against the Mariners. We want to see the same and uh, we want to see you on the pitch, man. So thank you for joining us. And uh, I love you. Cheers. Thank you. All right. Cheers. That was awkward. <laughs> see you later.